I'm driving into work today, and we have uh, we got snow up here in Oregon, which is great. Some parts of the country can't relate to this. We love snow in Oregon. We pray for snow in Oregon. We enjoy when there's snow in Oregon. I've been on the East Coast. This is like the world's worst news. Oh, they hate snow. What are they going to do? And I must tell you, it's a lot different level of snow. If we get dumped on in Oregon, I mean, I'm talking about a, what we would call a blizzard. You're talking about six inches. If you get a regular snow in Oregon, you're talking two inches. So it is significantly different than feet and feet of snow. But at the same time, it causes a significantly different reaction, which is that we love it. We look forward to it. Okay. So it's snowing today, a little bit relevant to my story. I'm coming in. This just happened. This is 10 minutes ago. I got in the elevator, came up here, and now I'm telling you guys this story. The buses out here in Oregon don't ever miss a stop. Okay, If you're you're a bus rider, you have something known as a schedule. If that bus tells you it's going to have you dropped off at 317, you will be dropped off at 317. If it says it's going to pick you up at 425, it will pick you up at 425. Now, that's almost like magic. How could a bus possibly, I go places all the time. I can't guarantee the time I'll be. I don't know what traffic's going to be. I don't know what the conditions are going to be. Today, we're dealing with snow. But these buses, rain, snow, shine, they make those stops on time every time. If somebody's trying to get to the bus and that bus has to go, they'll leave them. I've seen people run into bus. I'm sure you guys have seen this too, but I've seen this with my own eyes. Somebody's running for a bus. That bus pulls away and leaves them there if they're not on time. That's how they make their next stop. That's how they never miss. But with that said, they're also the bullies of the road. These guys will run you right off the road. If you ever end up in a showdown with a bus where you're both trying to merge into a lane, you need to hit your brakes and concede because that bus will not. I just dealt with this. That exact thing. Merging situation. I'm paying attention to where I'm supposed to be in my lane. And it's snowing. Not for nothing, but everybody's driving a little more slow. Everybody's a little bit more cautious. This bus is coming over into my lane. Now, the other side of the story, the bus also had the right. The lanes were merging. But there has to be give and take. I was not aware that the bus's lane was running out. In my defense, bus knows the route. Bus does this all the time. I'm not aware of it. I'm not. I'm supposed to be watching for other traffic. But I'm paying attention to what I'm supposed to be doing. And I'm doing it. Okay, great. So I speed up. I get in front of the bus. I make a right-hand turn. Now I've got a parallel park. What do I see coming around the corner? Very same bus. So now we keep each other honest. Bus was willing to run into me, willing to run me off the road. Fortunately, it didn't happen. Now I've got to jackknife my rig so I can get in my spot, which makes the bus hit its brakes. That's what we call keeping each other honest. Instead of the bus conceding that he was willing to run me over a moment ago, he instead, this actual driver with a bus full of people, reaches out his window and starts giving me the business with a hand, right, the hand language, as I'm trying to pull into my spot, which not for nothing is also a very appropriate thing to do if you're going to parallel park, and I have a big truck in a city. It's not easy for me, but you might cross the lane. If the lane was clear, you've got the right to do it. Happen to slow the bus down. I feel like we kept each other even, but I also feel as though I understand how buses are logistically so proficient day in and day out. They don't give a damn. So word to the wise, if you see a bus, understand the policy, concede to the bus. You might be better off.